Hi, welcome back to EducateTube.com. My name is Sitsuki, your host. Today I'll be showing you how to make an LED light, uh, 110 luminance, the one that you use for spotlight in your house, right? I got this for 8 bucks and convert it into a very bright flashlight, 110 luminance flashlight, running on a battery packed uh, uh, mobile system, right? So if I turn it on, let's see. There we go, it worked perfectly. All you need really is this LED light, uh, a, a Christmas plug that's thrown away, so I use as a Christmas plug that I didn't need any, anymore. Just any plug would do, just uh, you need a two terminal and you have a, a, a AC plug, plug it in. You can plug this directly to a um, outlet, your uh, house uh, plug, AC plug, or like myself, I have a battery pack system which uh, I can just plug directly to this one and now I have a flashlight great for camping great for one of the tools for survival apparently this um, uh, light bulb is supposed to last 25 to 30,000 hours I must, I must have one it's cool okay um, and my recommendation of course is do not uh, plug this directly to your uh, home outlet AC uh, plug uh, and leave it alone if you're gonna plug it in make sure you're there watching it because like I said, this uh, need to be um, uh, checked for you know, safety, and it hasn't been done that in terms of uh, you know conforming to you know the safety plugging into AC. So I would not recommend it. I know it's actually quite safe, but still, I won't recommend you do that. So just make sure you get one of these um, battery powered uh, pack mobile system and plug it directly there. Okay, uh, you can test it on your AC adapt at home but ultimately you need to get one of these um, battery pack system okay let's get started okay so the first thing you want to do is um uh, wrap the terminal securely okay like this here okay really tight make sure that it doesn't touch the other side okay you can see here uh, wrap it well make sure that it doesn't touch the other side right and then with a lens insulator tape where's my insulator tape? okay there it is okay this one and wrap around this wire Make it really tight and secure, okay, like this. Okay. And you want to do it one more time. So notice that there are two separate terminals. They're not in contact with the other. That's very important because this is where uh, you want to prevent uh, short circuit and ruin this uh, uh, light bulb, this LED light bulb. Even though it's eight bucks, it's still quite expensive. Um, you know, you don't want to be in. Like I said. Uh, also, you, it's fire hazard if it's short circuit. You know, you might shock yourself or might cause fire. So, make sure uh, you don't uh, you tight you put the tape in quite well. It's later tape, and like I said, do not plug it into the AC adapter uh, in your house. Okay, just do it just for experiment. On this video, I'm just showing you uh, how it works. But ultimately, you need to get a battery uh, packed device. And like I said, we're building a flashlight. We're not building in-house uh, spotlight. All right. Um, I mean, I know it works, but I don't guarantee uh, it's uh, safe in the sense that uh, you leave it alone by itself. It's not very good, right? Just just for prevention, you don't want to keep it want to keep it uh, safe. Okay, so I'm plug. So you can see as I'm wrapping around, I'm wrapping a lot of tape around this. Cause I'm just, just uh, you know, very uh, cautious about this. I, I really don't want to, you know, I want to make sure I did my best to keep its this device safe. And so that's what I do. I tape it well, and uh, that's what I did there. You can see. So there it is. Um, two side separate by a insulated tape and you do one more tape to tape it that keep it away from each other okay so there we go I mean keep it together I mean 
okay and so secure so that it's not going to be loose there we go and it's done okay you might want to do it one more time to wrap around this one as well and so keep it quite secure so you don't have a chance of touching the two turn just in case okay and there we go okay it's pretty uh, tight now it looks like a light socket right but it has a plug at the end so now, now the reason why this work is because the, the electronics component that converts the AC to DC is already built into this LED light so you don't have to worry about it you can see I can see some of these capacitor in there right um, I just actually I just see the capacitor but I'm sure there's other circuits in there as well um, and then uh, let's just to test it out I'll show you if you plug in directly to the AC adapter like I said just do it uh, temporarily like for a couple minutes right even a couple of seconds right and there we go it works very well it's actually worked right and it's very cool to touch no problem okay but like I said don't leave this on by itself just even though I'm pretty sure it's safe enough but just like any circuits that's not been you know tested properly right uh, you should always keep your eye on it or if you're not using it to unplug it right but uh, make sure you use uh, the power plug the battery powered uh, uh, plug instead so for example this has the AC plug and this is running on battery it's a hundred watt uh, battery pack so let's turn it on and if I plug it directly there we go it works perfectly okay so now you have this um, flashlight that runs on a power pack battery you can use it for camping right you can use it you know, for survival one of the, this is actually one of the great device to have during survival you know in case of case, worst case scenario because it's only 1.2 watt it probably lasts you for hours and very bright in addition because of this power pack you can use it to charge mobile etc etc again we have a system now in place where you can actually use this uh, LED light uh, running on a battery pack system so yeah amazing it's only eight bucks for this thing of course this uh, thing uh, you can actually if you look around you can probably get around 20 30 bucks for this okay so excellent uh, device to have around very bright uh, at night 110 luminance and it should last you 25 to 30,000 hours all right thanks educatetube.com